Get <laughs> 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 For a moment, I thought you were the sign of the Medjai, the lost protectors. I do. I am. What pains you, Nebet? My heart is broken. My truest friend, my husband, Eriks, has been murdered. Tell me what happened. He was renowned for his work. A soldier ordered him to build war chariots for the Pharaoh. He was happy to do so. But when the soldier returned to collect, he only offered to pay half the agreed price. Eriks refused, and the soldier cut him down and stole the chariot. If you are truly a Magi, will you help me get justice? Find the soldier and destroy the war chariot so he may not insult my husband's memory. I can do that for you. <laughs>
Did you ever see work as fine as Onirises? <laughs> What's this? Ah, scented oils. Might take the edge off the Tanner stench. Strong must clouds the air. Oh, the gods shame me, Neb. The Tanner is my husband. He carries that stench home whenever he returns from camp. Is he here now? By the smell? You would think so. But it's worse when he's around. Do not let it trouble you. 
We all must do work we do not relish. You are right. My husband works hard, but cannot keep up with the demand for his services. The Medjai are said to be legendary hunters. If you would like to earn some good coin, go and see him. I'm sure he could use your help. Hmm. I will consider it. Where would I find him? His hunting camp is north and west of Sao. He will be tanning hides for a few days. If only there was some... I wish I could afford one of his weapons. You are dead! Serpent of Serapis, you have heard the tragic tale? Not the whole of it. Oh, it was a true masterpiece. The shaft wrapped with water-hardened leather. The blade hammered out of the metal of heaven. I would love to see it. Impossible. I crafted it for one of Apollodorus's captains when I lived in Saïs. But Sefeto's soldiers killed him. That is the reason I left. Sefeto? Yes. Sefetu the Firebrand, who governs Saïs with flame and fear. One of his bootlickers stole the spear that bears my mark. Outrageous. Can you not get it back? The man is beyond my reach. He sails on one of Sefetu's triremes on Mariatus Lake. Ah, I hate a bully. My travels take me far and wide. If I come across him, I will look for your spear. I would love nothing more than to hear of his fall. If you manage it... The Serpent of Serapis is yours. I will sell to you later, Magi. A man is missing. Help him and I will help you. Oh. Reda spoke of. Dead. Stop you! Right there! Oh. Glad to hear this passing. But good news for you. His weapon was made for him special. Perhaps you'll have better use of it.
position get it Bayek, what good fortune! I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, men ahead. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The High Priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it servant of the goddess? Menehet will do, for one as good as family. As far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life, which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. Uh, description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. Your mother's side. Pick me up, Uncle Bayek! Ah, see now, there's no need to attack a man from behind. We're not numbering him four to one. Huh? You taught us to secure every advantage possible over a dangerous foe. Yes, yes, yes. And I am very dangerous! <laughs> Hide well, for the wanderer stalks your path!
Tina, you must come down from here. This would be a good place to watch the stars. Only the priests are permitted here. You know that. Yes, but I want to see if... Hush. Come down now. We can watch stars from the riverbank. out of there. children. Look at this. Fraud abounds in your market. And you claim you can do nothing? The dealings of the market are beyond me. Speak rather to the offending merchant. <laughs> Priest, you have proven as false as your mummies. Men ahead. Your brood is delivered safely home. Thank you, friend. Uh, what did that fool want with you? Some visitors, having purchased religious objects, are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them. Though not a merchant, I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand. This looks like a child made it. Did you hear where the bandits meant to go? Oh, I... The leader told the others to meet him at the necropolis, I think. We live nearby. I am not going home until I... Father, the book is gone. You will find Mother in the field of reeds without it. I promise. That warrior will find the book. Yes, yes. He will find it. These cat mummies are Do false. you know anything of flawed mummies sold to tourists? If you are not here to buy, I have no time for your questions. Menehet, the priest, is concerned about the... And I am concerned about my business. So keep your distance. You filthy naked yadet. How dare you try to trick me into paying for this job? <laughs> Greetings. I am... You have come to the right place, Neb. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false idols sold at the market. I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. <laughs> Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahed sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Yeah. I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. We are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. <laughs> Huh? 
Greetings. Can I help you? Indeed. See you soon. My friend, I am glad to see you have kept our appointment. Come, sit with me and share a drink of wine. I do not have time for that. <sighs> it is a beautiful night. Let us enjoy the coolness of the air for a moment before turning to business. Merchant, I am not here to take in the air. Who is behind the traffic of false icons? Well, you see, it is no simple story. There are many involved in this terrible affair, but they would all tell you the same thing. Pity the trusting man, for he suffers great pain. Seek evil, and you will always find it. No one will find it once we feed the as well as you can perhaps afford to be trusting. Talk, or you will meet the same fate as your friends. That will not be necessary. Among the dunes, southeast of here, is the bandit camp where the fake mummies are made. I suppose you would go and destroy it now. Better I smash the camp than your head. <whistles> Destroying these forgeries will earn the favor of the gods. As Ra lives, a disgrace.
Ah, here you are. <laughs> How can I ease the burdens of an old friend? Tonight, we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Isvet's chaos. But Pamu, our champion, is nowhere to be found. The High Priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sekhmet bless you. His home is near the market, but check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. Pamu does like a drink now and again. This must be Pamu. Ugh. The man stinks of beer. Oh, thank you. I've been trying to get him to leave for hours. Ahead. That is Pamu! What has happened to him? His passion for toasting Sekhmet has exceeded his head for drink. This is a disaster! People have come from the Red Land and the Black to see him fight! If a fight is all that is needed, I could replace him. Of course, Magi! You honor yourself in saving me from disgrace. Speak to the High Priest in the Temple Courtyard. He will take care of the rest. Your Holiness, I am here to fight for Sekhmet. You're not Pamu. He was meant to play Sekhmet. Pamu is... ill. He is recovering at the temple. Fine. Follow me.
Do not fear. Sekhmet will receive a fine tribute. Beloved of Sekhmet, who illumined the double land with her flame, we give thanks for your presence on this sacred night. We invite your witness. Should malice cling too strongly to your hearts, Isfet, the evil one, shall smite the goddess. Ah! And condemn Yamu to a hundred seasons of darkness. But should your hearts be pure, the goddess shall favor us, shielding us from the obscurity of chaos! Let the battle begin! It's a time unknown. Sehmet the lioness has shielded us from Isfet's greed. Isfet was once husband to Ma'at, goddess of all. Tampering with her scales of judgment, he of the souls of mortals. I could swear you were the blood eater herself. Ah, the priest's recounting of the battle between the goddess and Isfet was new <laughs> to me. It is a tale of his own invention. You will not hear it outside Yamu. Would that you'd agree to stay with us longer, but I know that greater duties call you. I'll say goodbye to the children before I leave. Do so. They'll miss you. You are always welcome in Yamu, whenever your journeys bring you to our gnome. Keep the mask and staff of the goddess as poor tokens of our respect.
strange to see bodies left out like this. The embalmer must know more. It is a shame to see three dead left neglected. What happened? They were just brought here, Magi. A family struck down by the sword. Only the daughter, Ira, survived. She carried them here one by one. Poor girl. All by herself now. A tragic story. Tragic indeed. Where is she now? You can find her on the abandoned date farm near the road where her family died. Ira sounds like a woman worth meeting. Soldiers. They must be us. Best they know. And how she does too. I should not be seen in this area. Find that girl! Let's finish this quickly! <laughs> soldiers heard that. Hail in peace, Iras. All I want is to speak with you. The last man to say so. Murdered my family. I've come to help you, Iras. How do you come to know my name? A priest told me of you. Ah. My kin have owned this land for centuries, but left it barren until now. A soldier came to us, saying his master held a deed of sale. My father refused to concede the property. Then, well, the rest is as you know it. What will you do? The farm is my birthright. I will work it as long as I can. I can ensure you are not harassed by soldiers. You may try. The villa they spoke of lies northwest of here, on the road to Alexandria. If you fail, tell the world... If you fail, tell the world I died... 
preserving my family's legacy. Papa, how do you know if you're in love? Why, Kemo? Do you think you are in love? I don't know. Love should feel good. You and Mama are the only ones I love. But this hurts. Sometimes I can't even think straight. <laughs> that sounds like love. It could be. 